Reporting from the Q Television Center with news from your region, we are the first for news that matters to you locally, regionally, and nationally. This is QTV News. Good evening. This is the Lifestyle News brought to you by QTV. I'm Bob Huggins. 200 full-time jobs have been announced at Teleperformance in Uri. The vacancies are part of an existing expansion in the company's contact centre. Teleperformance is one of the largest employers in Northern Ireland and employs around 1,000 staff at its Uri branch. Uri and Morn is among the bottom 10 recyclers in Northern Ireland's 26 council regions. Figures from the Department of Environment show that last year Uri and Morn recycled about 37% of its total household waste. Derry had the lowest rate at about 29%, while households in Antrim came out on top, recycling nearly 50% of their waste. There's been an aggravated burglary in Armagh. In the early hours of yesterday morning, three masked men entered a house in the Lisson Alley Villas area. Two men in the house, aged 46 and 39, were assaulted. The men were hospitalised for non-life-threatening injuries. And finally, the Ross Trevor Mountain Bike Trails, developed at a cost of £1.9 million, was officially opened today. Last week, Tourism Minister Arlene Foster attended the launch of the Castle Wellen Mountain Bike Trails. The minister says that the new trails are putting the Mourns on the map. Well, that's the latest. Stay up to date online with Lifestyle and listen to Q Radio. Good evening.